Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill rack daily challenge using Python programming language. First, we will understand our question. We have to accept the x and y integer from the user. Then we have to form the smallest possible even integer from x and y. Now let us take our test cases. These are our three test cases. So here the smallest possible even integer would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 7, 7 and 6. So here our output will be minus 1 because we have given a note that if not possible to form the even integer we have to print minus 1 so in this case we don't have any even integer so we have printed minus 1 so here we have 300456 so this will be our output now let us understand the key logic of our program take this test case so first we'll concatenate them then we'll sort them so by sorting we'll get this then after that we'll place the leading zeros in the first index or the first position that is after 3 so in order to produce this we will use the slice operation then we'll find the highest even integer in the number to form the possible even integer so here the highest even integer is 6 so we will remove it and add it at the last position here by by default by itself we have the 6 in last position then we'll concatenate them so this will be our output then we'll take our another test case so here you can see first we'll concatenate them we have no leading zeros here so we'll sort them and now we'll see for the highest even integer so it is 6 so we'll place this 6 at the last position and again we'll concatenate them so this will be our output so for your clear understanding we'll know by stepwise so the first step is as we see we will insert the leading zeros leading zeros at the first position or the first index then our second step is we will insert the largest even number or even digit at the last position. Let us implement our program. First, we'll get the x and y in the form of strings. Then we'll concatenate x and y and sort them. Then after that, for clear understanding, we'll take our test case. So here we will sort them 0, 0, 0, 3, 4, 5, 6. So this will be our sorted string. Now we'll count the number of zeros present in the test case. So zeros equal to num dot count of 0. So 
we have three zeros. So these zeros should be placed after three, right? That is here. So for that, first we will remove those zeros. So we use the slice operator. That is num equal to num of zero. So our zero should be placed right after three that is in the first index. So num equal to sorry num dot insert of the index position is one. So one comma zero. So this will produce three zero 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 four five six. Now after this we will initialize the even as minus one then for val in eight six four two that is in order to form the smallest possible even integer we are checking for the even integers in the number so if val in number we are going to remove it so here the even is six we will remove the val then assign it to even and break so six will be removed then it will be assigned to even so if the even is equal to equal to minus one that is we don't have any even integer we are going to print minus one else we are going to print the join of num which represents this then we will also have the even number so this is our program now let us execute our program first we'll pass our test case so we have got the smallest possible even integer as our output which is correct then we'll pass our second test case so here we have got minus one because there is no even integer then we'll pass this test case so it has given the correct output the smallest possible even integer hope you guys understand thanks for watching see you in next video